Today, we're talking about using LUTs in Sony Vegas versions 15 and later. Start with your clip on the timeline. You want to make sure that you're in the default workspace. You can do this by going to View, Window Layouts, and Default Layout. Next, click on the Video Effects tab, expand the All folder, and we're going to do some basic corrections. So let's drag the white balance effect onto our clip, and this will open up the Video Event Effects window. We're just going to select a white area on our clip and use the slider to change the amount of the correction. We can also use the brightness slider to increase the exposure a little. And we'll close that window. Next, you want to scroll up and find the LUT filter effect and just drag it onto your clip. Now in the video event effects window, you'll want to click the browse button, choose the LUT and click open. You can change the interpolation from good to best. We can use the strength slider to control the amount of the effect the LUT has on our clip. Next, you can click on the white balance tab to readjust some of the settings to suit your clip. And remember, LUTs should always be used as a starting point in your color correction workflow.